Coyote Nation. Happy Tuesday to you. It is so beautiful in Coyote Nation. I asked Rounder, I says, where do you want to do your video? Outside. Outside, baby. That's why we're outside. Yeah. Uh, it, Holy cow. It takes it's a genius to keep up with Spring is finally here. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Magnificent. Seems like we've been getting a lot of rain this year. Have we been getting a lot of rain? Oh, spring it rains. Yeah. You know, I guess so. Last time we were out here in the Sea Town Square. By the way, we're right outside of 1079, the Coyotes right there, Studio right there. in the Sea Town Square. Yeah. Last time we were out here, we had a big old incident right over here on the road beside us. <laughs> well, he took care of it. He, he just did. pushed it off the road. Yeah. Cop oh, just took good. it, pushed that car just right off the road. Man. I want to talk to you about that, about All right. the way people are dealing with each other. Okay. You know? Yeah. I've lived on the East Coast, I've lived on the West Coast, I've lived in the mountains, and I always come back to the Midwest because, like that, that old song, I want to live with the kind hearts and gentle people. Right, yeah. And I've noticed that since this coronavirus thing is hit, that people are really trying to be polite to each other. Have you noticed that? When uh, you try to go into a store, if you have to go into a grocery store or whatever, people are giving you the distance, they're being very careful not to get into your space and there's there's a real feeling of caring there yeah or politeness or w whatever you want to call it i think that's cool i do too i think it's really great i wonder if it's the same way everywhere or just in Coyote i Nation. don't i don't know but if you're watching this and you're not in the midwest let us know how it's going in your area just yeah. go to 107.9 the coyote what backslash Facebook or right. I don't, well, I can, I don't know. Well, well, there's your uh, your email is right there. They can send you an email. Yeah, send it to me and let right. me know how it's going in your part of the country right. because people here are being very, very polite to each other. Very wonderful. Yeah. You know, and, and you, this is, by the way, this is Rounder from the KC and the Round Man Show. Uh, three to six in the afternoon on 107.9 The Coyote. Uh, he's a big star. So, no. uh... So if you send him an email, you'll be sending an email to a big star. Now, I heard yesterday on your show that I'm just a big poopy. Well, the, I didn't say that. KC said that's, that. That's what I hear. Yeah. That's, that's the rumor on the street. Yeah. I'm just a big poopy. Big poopy? Yeah. Well, we can start calling you the big poopy. No, I, I'm fine with Rounder. It's yeah. fine. Rounder's good. Yeah. Hey, huh? just to repeat some things that KC said. Got this big boat race coming up on the 28th. Lake Race 2020. Yeah, that's the kickoff, the 28th down on the Strip. And that's going to be a big time. Uh, and Unless the gummit says you can't do it. The gummit? If the gummit says you can't do it, we probably won't do it. But if they do, that's going to be the kickoff to the first big party of the summer. Wow, and that will be something else, man, after being locked up and locked away for what, two, three months? See, I think people are ready to get outside. I'm pretty sure it's been a couple of years. Seems like yeah. it, doesn't it? Wow. I'm ready for this thing to be over. Me too. I think half of it, I mean, I could just be talking out the other end, but I think half of it's just been overblown media crap. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it I'm too. trying to be careful what I say here, yeah. but yeah. this sucks. Because you're responsible and I'm not, so I can say that, but you're a big star, so you have to be responsible. No, I think you're the big star. <laughs> I'm just a country bumpkin <laughs> and a big poopy. Casey and the Round Man have been nominated for best show at the lake again. They win it every year. So have you. And uh, Crystal and the Bear nominated in the morning, so 6 to 10. You. And uh, so be sure to go on and vote for one of them for just best not that show big, of the year. It's not that big a deal, yeah. folks. It's uh, not. It's not when you win it every hey, year. We like appreciate the vote. Do. But, yeah. Yeah. That's right. So I think we hit a cloud. Does that mean it's going to rain again? I don't know. It feels kind of good. It does feel good. Man, this is greatness. Yeah, I love it. I think we should take the rest of the day off. What'd you do this weekend? Anything? Uh, what did I do this weekend? I tried to reach you this morning. You were in some sort of a prayer meeting. Yeah, or I was something. in a Bible study this morning. Yeah. yeah. You, you were trying to reach Thanks me? Thanks a lot for responding. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't even. Did you send me a text? I sent you two texts. Oh, wow. I guess I that's should, probably where the confusion was. I think you too. I should check my text. Yeah, you probably should. Okay. So, uh, anything you want to tell me here on the air? I just thought we'd do this on the coyote deck. Oh! The weather was so nice. I forgot you had this Tuesday morning thing going yeah, on, so yeah. we won't be on the deck anymore. Wow. 
Yeah. I guess we'll have to live with this. This is yeah. You know, this this is terrible. Yeah. Terrible out here in the parking lot. A lot of traffic. That coyote deck is great fumes, though, isn't it? A lot of exhaust fumes. Hey, you know we won a big award on the coyote yeah, deck we last did. year. By Good golly, for you. Uh, the 1079, the coyote won uh, like first place in the state of Missouri for uh, for radio station video. Yeah. So uh, and they called it Coyote Deck. Because that's where we were most of the time. Right. Was on the Coyote Deck. Right. But uh, now we're in the parking lot. What, what just happened? There? Having fun. I, uh, Was that little video work? Got or? a little shot at the sign up ah, there. You know, the yeah. uh, 1079. The yeah. Coyote you sign. should stop doing that. Yeah, I guess so. I got a big fat finger there, don't yeah. I? Yeah, you're. That giant finger. Yeah. Well, that's not the only thing that's giant on me, baby. Okay, enough. Don't need to hear that. <laughs> Okay, so on the Casey and the Round Man show, uh, you put out an easy question when you start the show every day. I try to make it easy because I want winners. Right, and you and get a you winner every day. At four o'clock, yeah. you put out a really hard question. I put out a really hard, who can it be now? Da -na 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 -na. Uh, and then we give you an opportunity to win another prize. That's a big B, man. That's yeah, a wasp, wasp is what that is. And then at five, you have on the world famous KC and the Round Man show, you have the world famous Secret Sound. Did you get a winner yesterday? We did not. Ooh. I thought we were going to, but we did not. That's still the same sound yeah. from last week? Yep. Wow. Because you were so well, close. We were, we, but we took three days off last That's week. true. Wow. It's, it's rough to be the owner of the station. Just take three days off. You know, sometimes it is rough to be the owner of the station. <laughs> I'm glad you brought that yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Actually, that's very true. I mean, you guys, <laughs> as the owner, as the business owners, whatever small business it might be, they're the ones taking the chances, man. They're, you know, I mean, that's not all that easy. Uh, we're navigating. It's okay. Although you can take three days off when you feel like You know, you know hey. I just... I just want to do what I want to do, not what some guy in a corporate office tells me what to do. The government. The government. I don't like the government telling me what to do. That's right. You know, I got nothing against our governor, but he can't tell me when to open my door and when not to open my door. And I don't know what law he thinks he can do that with, but I need to see it. We've been experiencing some weird stuff the last few months with all this stuff, man. I mean, it's been crazy, but hopefully we'll be getting back kind of the normal fairly soon. You know, the weirdest thing was a herd of wild dogs that came through here last, last night. That really was weird. I missed that. Yeah. I must have left before they came through. Yeah. What, what, what they were caused quick. all that? I don't know. I don't know. It's part of this uh, virus thing. I were think. they howling? Co oh, yeah. The co coyote howl? Uh -huh. woo, woo, yeah. woo. That woo, might have something to do with it. You know, I hear the coyote howl in my sleep. <laughs> I do, really. I hope that you do too. We thank you so much for being Coyote Nation because that's the reason we're here and the reason we're able to have this much fun. Be sure to check out Casey and the Round Man Show today, three to six, right after Jamie Turner, 10 until three. Uh, of course, Crystal and the Bear in the morning and Fitz at night and you can't miss the Renegade Radio Sports updates right around 35 past the hour whenever they decide to nominate for the best show on radio Let me on the air absolutely all right so have a great tuesday uh, i guess we got more rain coming in tonight uh so batten down the hatches we'll talk to you with jason stapleton tomorrow he'll give us some business wisdom learned by no, Rounder. don't tell him that. Rounder taught him don't everything he knows. When you watch him tomorrow, don't blame me. <laughs> don't. <laughs> Until then, God bless you. Good job. Boy, it's fun out here, isn't it? A lot of diesel. Yeah. A lot of diesel smell. Nothing like the smell but of man, diesel You know what? That morning. could be you. Eh? Oh, that could be me. We're so pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Obviously not prescription glasses you have on. Obviously not. Hey, we need more of us. Right? I'm ready. We're so pretty.